What's going on guys? Welcome back to some more Vikings reactions. Okay, so we are back again. Season 3, Episode 4. No, 5. <laughs> season 3, Episode 5 is here today. And we're just gonna just jump right into it, man. We already know what's going on. The Wanderer has left after um sleeping with Ragnar's wife Queen Aslog Siggy is dead as I said she was the MVP of the last episode she went out I don't know I think this guy when he does stuff people has to be sacrificed I think anytime he uses his powers or whatever it is his magic or whatever I think people has to be sacrificed I think you get what I'm saying? Like, I think that's what has to happen when he uses his powers, <laughs> you, you know? So, we have Quintrit, who is now Queen of Mercia. She is, she killed her brother, poisoned her brother. Um, I don't know what happened between, I mean, I know she pissed on Ragnar because, <laughs> because of the wound. That's about it but i don't know if they slept together because you know i would think that if that happened they would have showed it but we don't i don't know for sure but i do know what's going on between mr athelstan and his and his bay um ethel wolf's wife um so i like their relationship and as i said before i'm not i'm not a condoner of um adultery i think it's wrong um but in this case where it's like an arranged marriage um i'm not i'm saying still you should never break the vow of marriage and you know commit adultery but they seem like they genuinely genuinely in love but somebody did see them kissing we still don't know who saw them um kissing i don't know if Aethel wolf is going to find out and kill her I don't know what's going to happen. So, let's jump into the episode, man. And all I'm saying, this season is good um, so far. Um, Perun was kind of blaming Bjorn in the last episode about, you know what I'm saying, kind of like, oh, you're enjoying yourself while, you know, I'm recovering or whatever the situation is. I don't think Bjorn is the type of person that's going to um, look down on Perun, you know, because he he's like eating up. He blames himself for what happened to her. So, and she not understanding that and like seeing the pain on his face or or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just kind of inconsiderate of her. Even though I know she's in the more vulnerable state right now, I do understand. From both perspectives, I do understand. Um, so, yeah, man. Floki's still on his religious stuff. Um you know and Ragnar is just trying to understand things and be he's just trying to be more he's just a curious guy and great people are like that great leaders they're like that they're just curious they're resourceful they want to know more that's just how it is and let's jump into this episode man see what's going on um so one thing I want to address if you do watch this intro one thing I do want to address is that guys a lot of people have been asking me about making donations to the channel, so I'm going to make that available for you guys, okay? This is not a forced thing. The link is going to be down in the description. It's a PayPal account because it's going to take me a little bit more time to get my Patreon up where, um, where I'm comfortable enough to know that I can provide that content to Patreon. Then I will make Patreon available. I'm also not the type of person who likes to do this, but so many people keep asking, asking about it that I feel like I had to kind of do it. So if you want to make donations to the channel, it does not matter. Um, don't force yourself to, to do a hell of a lot. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Even though I know, you know, but whatever you can do, whatever you feel like donating to the channel or whatever, um, trust me. You know it's gonna go back into the, the the improvement of the channel anyways so um, the link is down in the description it's a PayPal it's gonna be um, at 
um, terabyte reacts um, 1985 gmail.com so that's going to be it but as I said just click the link and go donate okay thank you very much <laughs> all right so I'll see you guys for the upcoming episode let's get it All right, so this episode was kind of, it went the way I kind of expected it to go in some aspects. The last part was, was a bit surprising, but the performance, it was not convincing. And that's why I was like, I think this was his plan all along. First of all, like, it was like, oh, I want to talk to my son alone. Immediately, I was like, okay, <laughs> okay, this was a plan. This was the plan. Um did not catch me off guard really <laughs> it really didn't you know so when it when it comes on to the 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 um the other parts of the episode was really really interesting really really interesting what was taking place um finding out that that harvard was actually odin not who i thought it was which is um mimir so i was like okay harvard is a god that's what we found out first and then Floki revealed to Ragnar that it was Odin, that it was, it, Harbard is another name for Odin. Um, so, so, so Odin had sex with, with, with Aslog. Okay. So, um, I don't know what this is going to lead to or whatever the situation is. Um, I'm glad that the secret was out and this wasn't being strung along for many episodes. And we're wondering when is Ragnar going to find this out? Now he knows how will he respond? I don't know. Um, I think Ragnar, in my opinion, I think Ragnar should back Lagatha a lot better. I, I don't know. I don't know why he's so kind of standoffish with her and kind of was, you know, when he was talking to that dude, he kind of like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't know why he slights her so much. You know what I'm saying? And I think he's still... I think he still resents the fact that she left that one time, even though she had all right to leave. Bjorn tried his best to, to keep Lagatha there. I don't know what Lagatha and old guy has planned. Maybe they're planning to overthrow the whole the whole thing, go against Ragnar somehow. Maybe plan to go against him in the future or something like that. I don't know, but I'm going to keep that in mind. Because if she's going to team up with him, you know, if she's going to team up with him, um, that's the only thing I can think of where she would, you know, leave to, to go back. So I'm like, where is she going? Didn't she get turned down? But at the same time, you know, they left that kind of open ended for you to kind of try to figure out what's what was really going on. So I'm definitely looking forward to see more episodes of this season. Um, you know, I don't know. It, it, King Edbert is playing a game. He's playing a game that I think is going to cost him. I really do think it's going to cost him. Um, as I said before, I think he got spooked by the ritual. I think that's what really spooked him and let him change his mind about, you know, letting them in. I think, or, I don't know. He's a mysterious character to say the least. Um, I don't know what to think. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I... I I don't know what to think of his, of his character right now. He's a real tricky and sly king that you can't re really put your hands on to say, okay, this is the type of person he is because he's playing a game that I think is going to not be okay for him in the long run. I, I don't think it's going to be good for him in the long run. So um, I don't know how they're going to, how they're going to hear about this. Um, Maybe, maybe, um, Judith will try to send word to Athelstan somehow. I don't know if she might, maybe she'll run away. Who knows what she'll do? You know what I'm saying? Um, but I think she's going to be the one that orchestrates how they find out back in Kattegat that this went, that they killed all, all the freaking Northmen over there in England. They're planning to go to Paris. Um, I don't know how I feel about all that, but <laughs> you know. Um, that's what they did back in the day. You know what I'm saying? They were all over the place trying to conquer here, conquer there. So 
I, I'm all for it. I'm all for it. Um, it. Personally, I did not know that that Paris was an established city so far back. Cause this this is happening way back, way way back. I didn't know that the actual city of Paris was called Paris back then. I you know I actually thought um, that maybe later on they named it Paris. I don't know why I've, I've thought that, but. You know, because it's very true for so many different places, you would think, you know what I'm saying? So many places that have their name today has, ch you know, has changed their name, um, you know, from year from years before, you know, new, new wave, whatever. So thank you guys so much for tuning in, man. That's about all I have to say about this review. I'm looking forward to to um, to seeing more episodes of vikings man it's an awesome series and i'm enjoying this season so far so thank you guys so much for tuning in make sure you like the video and also subscribe to the channel if you're new leave a comment in the comment section man you guys are slacking you guys are slacking these viking videos like i don't know if people just don't like my reactions of vikings i don't know what it is but you know, like lately, my Viking videos are struggling to get a hundred views. It's crazy. So, but it is whatever. I'm still going to watch and, and, and put it up. So thank you guys for the ones that are staying loyal and watching the series with me. And thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, man, it's Terabyte Reacts. And I will see you guys next time for some more Vikings reaction. Peace.